What's good to my YT fam? It's your girl, Shayla Shay, and today I am bringing to my YT fam a voiceover cooking video for you guys. Today I'm cooking fried sausage and peppers, and here I am showing you guys two sausages that I will be using for the meal and the frozen peppers and onion, and also pepper and butter and all the other utilities that you would need for this meal. So the first thing that I will be doing in this cooking video is adding the butter to the to the skillet. So while I'm doing that, go ahead and hit that like button. Comment down below what you think of this video. Subscribe to my channel if you have not and hit the notification bell. So I turned this oven the stove on on six and the next thing that I will be doing is cutting up this on um, the uh, sausages if you're not already please go check out my recent videos that I made for you guys the first video um, was in my purse the second video 20 facts about me and my third video is just a mini morning routine that I do every morning so here I am cutting up the sausages. Just cutting up the sausages. Cutting up the sausages and cutting up the sausages. <laughs> and I want to thank you guys for subscribing to my channel and staying with me and watching my videos. Please um please go ahead and watch this video to the end. And I'd be happy even more. And to all my viewers, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not already. So now you can cut them out. You can cut it out, cut them up however you want them. There's really no specific way how to cut sausages. If you want them small, just cut them small. Here I am, just add them to the pan with the butter in it. And here I am stirring them up to get them all inside the butter. And here I am about to cut the other one. And now y'all can see I'll be a lot of tongue twisted because I talk, I don't talk much, but when I talk a lot, I get tongue twisted. So please bear with me in, the, in this video. So here I am. Stirring up the sausage that's inside the pan. So I have my helper with me. It's my older son that's stirring up the sausages for me as I cut the other sausages. And he's stirring them up in the pan as I put them in the pan. Still cutting them up. All right, so I am done cutting up the, sa the sausages. So now I just let them cook, let them get brown before I add the um, frozen peppers and onions. So yeah, as y'all can see that I brought my light so that I can see the sausage more better and that it won't be dark. So hopefully that would do for you guys. And here he comes, stirring the sausage up some more to get him brown, even, um, even, evenly cook on each side. I like mine's a little bit like, uh, not burnt, but like you can see the darkness on the sausage, like a crispy type of deal. All right, guys, so as you can see, that the color is changing to the, um, Golden brown as I like it as he um, flipping and turning the sausages. Okay, so here I, I add the peppers and onions to the sausages. So as you can see, that's 
I added half of the bag at the moment, but I will add the rest down the line. So here my son is stirring up the sausages and peppers. So at this point, you still want the sausages to get brown like you like it, and but you want to make sure that the peppers are not frozen still you want to make sure they are cooked and soft and I did turn the stove down to medium for a minute so the peppers can cook with the sausage so the sausage won't get as dark and here I do take out the seasonings that I'm going to be using to put inside the blend, the mix. So pepper, garlic, salt, and parsley is what I am taking out to put in. Okay, now since he started stirring up the peppers and sausages again, here I am adding the pepper to the um, to the blend. The pepper, it don't matter how much you want to put in your um, what's name. If you want a spicy, add more pepper and garlic salt. Just season it to your likings and parsley. I like parsley because it's color add more color to the food and here he is turning it up some more and I did turn the stove up a little bit more to get it going even more so now I'm just gonna let it cook and let and I did put the rest of the peppers and onions inside the uh, sausages so now I'm just gonna cuz I like a lot of peppers in my stuff and I did turn it up to six all right so now I'm just gonna let it cook and let everything blend in together and I did stir it constantly constantly to make sure it doesn't stick and make sure you don't like you know when it's done when there's like a lot of juice inside the skillet with the meat because from the peppers pe peppers do make water so you want to make sure that there's no pepper no water inside the meat so you know when it's done or not so here's my son stirring it up some more And here I am patting them down so the steam can stay at the bottom, but well, not the steam, but so it can cook more and get browner more at the bottom of the sausages. Let them cook other than keep missing them up, if y'all know what I'm saying. So now we're just letting it cook and letting it cook. I'm not going to let the whole video go through as you're just watching it cook. So to me, guys, this is like a healthy, hearty meal to me, sausage and peppers. I always thought that this would be a healthy, hearty meal. If y'all don't, that's on you guys, but I always like it because, like I said, I think it was a healthy hearty meal to me but you can put sides with it it don't matter what size you add on with it but y'all will see at the end of the video I did cook some rice and I added some rice to the bottom of my bowl and then the mix on top but yes it is still cooking and cooking and cooking I did not mix it up yet Alright guys, so as y'all can see that I am stirring 
it up one more time make sure ain't nothing stick into the pan everything gets together blended together make sure my peppers are soft and ready to be eaten not that good stuff so as y'all can see i put the thumbs up for you guys i turn the stove off and now let's get so in my bowl i added not one not two but three scoops of rice now everybody don't like sweet rice i love sweet rice some people's like salt in their rice and butter in their rice salt and butter or seasoning if you like that go ahead and do that to your rice and you can still add on um, the toppings so here i am adding on my sausage and peppers to my rice i added like three scoops of that as well y'all that looks so good just watch it like it, your mouth will get watery like bruh <laughs> so as y'all can see that i am done with my bow this is the finian touch the finny the finny the finish touch of my bow but i hope you guys enjoy this video don't forget to comment down below what you think of this video Subscribe to my channel if you have not. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss out any more of my videos that I upload for you guys. Don't forget to push that like button as well. And I will see you guys in another video. Thank you for watching.